The saws are buzzing in Kelly Welch's custom cabinet shop, which means business is good. Even during the recent downturn in construction, he's had plenty of work. But when he was starting out, his wife Pam says it was a different story. Business was not well, and the construction was dried up. Kelly took whatever jobs he could find. It was here, there, might have to work at night. If you got a job, you basically really had to take it to make some money to pay bills. It was just getting worse and worse. Um, we had our electricity turned off. As the bills piled up, Kelly prayed for strength. Keep me, you know, let's keep going. I mean, I knew something was going to come. I just didn't know when or how or what we really had to do. Then Pam started watching the 700 Club, where she heard Pat Robertson talking about what God says about finances and giving. He said, test me, prove me. When you give, see if I will not open the windows of heaven and pour out a blessing so great, I, you won't be able to contain it. At first, she didn't fully understand. And then... It just came to me, give, and it shall be given to you. And I was, you've got to be kidding me. That's how simple it is. And, and I wrote a little $10 check, and I sent it in. And within one week, my husband was offered a job from zero to $1,000 a week. I was able to pay every bill in full with money left over. From then on, we've always been able to pay our bill, which somebody had slapped me in the head sooner. <laughs> Ever since then, they never stopped giving. In fact, they started giving more. I knew what God was going to do if I just continued to be faithful. And so we were. What God did was provide their every need. Today, Kelly's cabinet shop is busy as ever. To this day, my husband has never advertised. He doesn't even have a sign on his shop. Working in the construction world, the Welches know about the ups and downs of finances, but they encourage people that no matter what, stay the course. He said that he would meet all of my needs according to his riches and glory through Christ Jesus, and he has, and he still does.